Hello and welcome back to Bite Size Breakdown, everyone, with your usual host, King Demps. Um, today we're going to take a look at a round between MIBR and Complexity. This is from the Blast Spring groups. And this is just a nice little eco pistol strat that MIBR ran that I think has multiple uses. Um, but let's just look at it. So MIBR invests two smokes and a Molotov in order to get Woody into this position here on top of Mini. As you can see, they've invested all of their time and resources, even taking a bit of utility damage just to get Woody on top of Mini here. Now, the rest of the team are going to slowly work their way back towards Lobby, as you can see happening here. And they're going to default in Lobby and just take a little bit of time. Now, what it seems they're looking for is potentially for somebody to poke their head through, maybe to get a little bit of information. But on this kind of missed smoke, Burnzan is actually going to take a few liberties and he's going to take a little bit of space. And in a moment is actually going to get the kill on JT. Now, what is important to watch here is watch how MIBR react once this kill on JT comes through. As you can see, he's actually going to think twice about it. Ends up getting that pick. And then he's also going to push through here and get the info that the AWPA is in hell. Now, what we can see on the rest of the map is MIBR are going to start to move. And then Woody on top of Mini is also going to move as well. Now, what this setup kind of looks like with three in lobby and then one on top of Mini here. It kind of looks like the guy on top of Mini is going to jump in and they're going to crunch the upper, upper, the upper bomb site. Now, what they do instead, as you can see here. We'll just let the round go a bit. Is they're actually going to, once they hear that molly go down, once they get a little bit of further information that no one's going to do any push, they actually decide to go towards ramp. And Woody is going to ramp towards ramp as well. Now, the reason I quite like this play is because they saw the AWPA in hell. They know that the CTs are going to have to rotate because their ramp player died. So the area of the map that MIBR decide to target is that rotation point of ramp slash hell. They know if the AWPA sticks around, they might be able to get up in his face and maybe rush him down with the pistols. They know that there's a good chance the complexity are going to have to have given up outside because lower has become weaker, ramp has become weaker. They're going to have to do some rotations in order to, to sure up the defense. And sure enough, if we go and take a look at Fang here, Fang is actually now kind of hanging around in this kind of lower area. He was in secret earlier in the round. But he's had to rotate as a result of this pressure that MIBR have put on. And as you can see, Woody basically gets a free ride here all the way down to ramp to join his teammates with the attack. And basically what this means is MIBR get this lower bomb site for free. There's no real contest. They pick up the gun, which is very, very nice. And they actually make this round very competitive. Woody here gets a very important frag. Now, at this point in the round, it looks like it's done and dusted for MIBR. It very much seems like there's not much of a way complexity are going to be able to get back into this round. However, we're going to see both Grim and Floppy get nice and aggressive. So, Floppy here comes up. And before they can get into post plants, and then Grim also got the kill on the planter. I've ended up missing all of them. But they basically shut this round down. Now, all in all, just a really, really nice round there. Um, MIBR, very, very nice to have this idea where they set... Why does it draw the lines like that? Stop doing that. Very nice idea to set Woody up here to get that pick on ramp and then to utilize that to kind of crunch the ramp area and head down to the lower bomb site. I think that's just a very, very nice pistol strat. And from where Woody was on mini, they also could have turned it into an inner hit. So I think it's kind of multi-purpose getting Woody into that position on top of mini. Really nice idea from MOBR. I like it a lot and it very, very nearly worked out. If not for the fact Floppy and Grim got nice and aggressive, they didn't let MIBR set up in post plants, get in positions where they've got crossfires or where they're going to be difficult to dig out of those positions. They got up into their face quickly before the bomb went down, and that was exactly what allowed Complexity to win the round in the end. Now, if you like that, guys, you know the drill. Comment, like it, subscribe, and all that jazz. Uh, and if you didn't like it... I guess there's no accounting for taste.